What's the guy that I fancied? Sheldon. Sheldon. <laughs> yeah. Who's your fave? I fancy him too. My fa- We don't normally fancy the same guy. No. Uh, I like Brooke with the short Oh, yeah. Fringe. And I like Luke, Luca Magnotta guy. Oh, God, he terrifies me. <laughs> Why is he wearing that suit? I think he's a good housemate, though. Honestly, if you've ever to listened to any of the podcasts about Luca Magnotta, and if you haven't seen Don't Fuck With Cats, did you listen you to the one I sent, I sent you where they watched in the vi- all the videos? Stop and shit. it. That is bad, isn't it? That was terrible. And it bad. Because it was you. children. I know. Um, but it had fuck. the audio from him auditioning for all these reality shows. Oh, uh, yeah, and I remember that. It just gave yeah. me vibes from that guy. Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> what God. a weird guy that guy is. Mm-hmm. Weird, I'll say. Mm-hmm. Um, Who's your pick to win? <laughs> I can't remember who anyone is. No, I can't. Someone like Bland. Oh, it's far too early to say who could win. Say, can you? Maybe we could say who might go. I think that like, Nico will go, don't you? Wait, who saved herself? Uh, me, and, m- me and yeah. me. So she's now safe. Yeah. And like, so it's either that girl. The girl with the teeth. Yeah, or. The Nico. girl with the hair who's the cocaine. No, he ain't one. It was uh, the beard guy. Oh, the beard guy. Yeah, yeah the sorry. beardy hypnotist. And I don't want him to go because I want Nico. to see him do some hypnotism. Oh, yeah. I don't mm. want to see if that's going to be a thing. Sorry. But I don't think that can work unless you're in an environment where you expect to be hypnotised. Because isn't it all about the power of suggestion, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, but maybe he can say to them, do you mind if I hypnotise you? And they go, yeah. And then he's like, hmm, you are going to vote out. So, so is hypnotism sex. real, do you think? No, it's a low point. Even Darren Brown says it's bollocks. What about when they used to do it on TV back in the day? Like, Oh, make people cluck like a chicken. Yeah, stuff. all that. That was quite it's just, popular, wasn't it, in the 90s? Just, yeah, like Paul McKenna or whatever used yeah. to do it. I think it's just people sort of playing along, but I don't really know. I ha- I got hypnotised. Did you? Yeah, about, because of my eating disorder. And the guy hypnotised me, and I just thought, I'm not hypnotised. I don't feel hypnotised. It's a load of rubbish. Oh, so it didn't work on you? No, because I'm not, I'm not a fucking naive little fucking drinking the Kool-Aid fence sitter. I've got mind on my own, so... Mm, too wanna, cynical for don't want to be cured of that eating disorder. <laughs> having it. Stubborn. <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah, I'd like to see how that's going to play out, how he, how he thinks he's going to do it. Mm-hmm. Don't you need some sort of, you know, like in Get Out, where they're like, the good woman's stirring the teacup. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if he's got the teacup out, you need yeah. to be careful. But it's, he didn't play along with it. She just sort of forced him into it, didn't she? Yeah. He was just sort of oh, sat that's there. that's true. Yeah, she made him do it. So mm. there you go. It's proof. Mm, definitely. It's a true story, that. <laughs> proof. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's about it, really. Well, we'll have a lot more to say next week, won't we, once we've seen how it all starts to filter out hopefully I hope I'm feeling more on form with this mm. tooth condition I've got I feel like this podcast not been very good it's a bit dry yeah it's dry but, you know well, because we don't know yet. anyone yet we don't know all it is is just us commenting on like the way they look and the way they're dressed and that's just shallow <laughs> frankly I want to get to know them as people <laughs> <laughs> better get that live feed on yeah. oh god yeah I'll listen to some other podcasts and find out other people's opinions and come back to you should we go wrap it Follow me on Twitter, light at VM. Follow me on Twitter, BB underscore superfan. Follow BB on Blast. And at BB on Blast. <laughs> tell a friend, retweet us. If you actually like this, why not retweet us, like it, all that sort of stuff. No one watches BB on Canada. We need all the help we can get. Let's all look after each other. <laughs> and uh, read my yeah. book, First Aid Kit Girl. Ah, my boyfriend's reading that book at the moment. Yeah. It's very good. He says it's good. Rave reviews. Gaz ain't read it. Not yet, but <laughs> we tend to pass books to each other oh, when we're okay. done, so oh, careful. it'll come down Corona, my way in the pipeline. Coronavirus. <laughs> <laughs> did I give you that book? Or did he buy it? He bought it. Did he? Yeah. Oh, that's even better. Uh, <laughs> and we'll be back, I don't know when, next week. Next week sometime. Next week sometime. Watch this space. Mm -hmm. Have a lovely evening, weekend. And send us an email. If you've never interacted with us before, we want to hear from you. And if you have, Mm -hmm. who who normally emails us? If you're a lurker. I don't know. Oh. Oh, the guy that you think's nice looking. Matthew Pagazani. Matthew Pagazani. He tweeted us. He tweeted us today. Mm. But I didn't look at it because I thought it might have a spoiler in it. I don't want to look at have, it. Uh, did he? I think he did tweet both of us. Have a quick look. I've just done the wrap up. If, yeah, I know. But if you're also, if you're bored, I was watched Love is Blind on our Facebook page. And I might watch the That is such it, a I know, that show is rotten. I think they're all actors. It's stupid, isn't it? But anyway. Who goes into a show thinking they're going to get married within oh, like I love five you. days? I love you. Or whatever it is. I love Fall you. Love. Never even fucking seen the person. Never even... Oh, it's 
There's a UK one coming, apparently. Oh, that'd be even worse. At least Americans... No, we almost, I don't think we'll fall for it. We're almost cynical. No. Uh, no one's going to say I love you to someone they ain't met. That's for sure. Um, is it on, to the BB and Boss account? No, I think it was to my... How oh, am I going to see that? Um, I'll see. I can't look at that. I forget. It was to be on blast, I think. Anyway, he said something like, I didn't look at it properly because I was worried about spoilers, but he said something like, it's shaping up to be a great season. Why is someone tweeting us about Big Brother 4? Oh, is that the last oh the because weekend? Luke retweeted our podcast and they said, oh, this is really good, thanks for recommending it, and then they went back into our archives. Oh, okay, good. So that's cool. Sweet. Shout out that person. Oh, yeah, by the way, we're available on Spotify, iTunes, and... Anywhere else you listen to podcasts, but you found us somehow, so there's point, probably point in telling you that. Shout out that person who was on um, Shout listener. out to Dean Barney. Yes. Who um, has been listening back to our Big, Big Brother UK archives. He's in that filing cabinet room as we speak. <laughs> anyway, thanks for listening. See you soon. Bye. Bye.